we are basically crossing the North Channel. That's actually so impressive. We are gonna go into, in, in, into the States. Oh Celebrating today for being done with another section of the loop. Everybody starts from zero. We just decided to put it all on YouTube. <laughs> for your enjoyment pleasure. Hi, we're Jen, Elliot, and Ollie. In 2019, we left the United States and backpacked through 11 countries, all before deciding to come back home and try something completely new, pivoting into boat life. Our current adventure is America's Great Loop, a 6,000 mile journey through small towns, big cities, and the wilderness from the eastern portion of the United States, through the Great Lakes and Canada, and down the Midwest rivers, all aboard our home on the water, Pivot. Make sure you subscribe as we share our journey through the highs, lows, and everything in between. Systems are looking good. Good morning from Turnbull Island, Canada. In the North Channel. We are leaving Canada today. It's very sad. We've had so many good memories here, and it's going to be a beautiful day. Like you can just tell, like the birds are chirping, the bugs are buzzing, the sun's just like coloring the sides of the clouds. It's awesome. We are leaving particularly early this morning at sunrise so we can have the best possible weather to go. Because so. we are basically crossing the North Channel. Um, and the North Channel is, is a pretty large body of water, water, especially on the west side, which is where we're going. Yeah, so let's go. We actually rocked and rolled a little bit all day yesterday because the wind was coming this way and we feel like it was making a current through here, through the islands. And so we had a wind versus current situation. Which is strange because we haven't had hardly any current since um, the Trent Severn. And we have pulled up the track from yesterday to follow the exact route through these rocks. Ready?
a little choppy this morning, more than we thought it was going to be. Basically, the winds that we had last night picked up a pretty decent swell, and they didn't stop um, as early as we thought they were going to. So they kind of stopped in the early morning today. So there's still residual swell coming from the west. We have a little bit of wind coming from the north, but just a little bit, like under 10 knots. But the combination of those two has just made it pretty choppy. Nothing too bad, but not uh, as smooth as uh, we like to cruise. Can you guess which bowl is Elliot's and which bowl is Jennifer's? Hers? His. <laughs> this morning we're having oatmeal. It's a bit chilly this morning, given that we're up so early and too that there's some wind. So uh, we're having some oatmeal because it's nice and warm. Warms you from the inside out. And uh, Elliot has his with apple, cinnamon, and peanut butter because we had an apple. And I have mine with a peach because it's our last peach and some cinnamon and a little bit of brown sugar. We're about halfway done with the cruise for today. Maybe a little shy of halfway. And overall, it's gotten a lot better. It was a little choppy at the beginning. I think what we learned in this cruise is that the wind and the conditions from the previous day really have an effect on the water conditions the next day. And so we're just kind of learning how long it stays and how it affects the boat and all that kind of stuff. So we're learning as we have been doing this whole entire trip. But overall, it's gotten a lot more smooth, calm, much more enjoyable. I'm really looking forward to the destination for today. It'll be really cool. But I'm also really sad to leave Canada. We are on the border and by. of the U.S. and Canada. We're turning off the autopilot. We are going to go into, in, in, into the states. Oh in my five, gosh. four, three. three. Make sure. oh yeah, let's make sure we don't hit any boats. Yeah. There's no boats out. No boats. No boats. All right. Four. Five. Three. Four. Three. Two. Two. Is it the red line or the black line? The red line. We might be here for another minute or two. No, it's so close. Red line, red line, black line. Uh, we left Canada. <laughs> we're not in Canada anymore. Not in the States either. <laughs> Five, oh, four, four, three, three two, two. <laughs> one. Michigan! Michigan. <laughs> Woo! 
we're actually we're just skirting the line between the two countries uh, until we kind of cut on over into detour. But it's oh, it's crazy. How do you feel? I feel really sad that we left. It's been so much fun. We run an online business, and it's very hard to run when you don't have Wi-Fi and connection, which we will be solving in the next like I don't know three or four days um, with a very special package that's coming. But it's been really, really nice to be like so off the grid in Canada. It's just been very rejuvenating. And I feel like all the time that, like even just being off the grid, but also how isolating the past like North Channel has been, it's been incredible. I'm like really, really sad to leave. I'm excited for Michigan, but I'm really sad to leave. And now, what do you think, Ollie? Does Michigan have rocks? I think Michigan has rocks. Oh, I think I like Michigan. Oh, oh boy. boy, there'll be some rocks, oh, some, some I good think rocks. I like Michigan quite a lot. Today for lunch we have leftovers. It's leftover tacos, so it's refried beans, pickled onions, Mexican cheese, homemade guac, and yeah, looks pretty good. Today, all of today's um, dinner, well, for the next like maybe a day and a half, we're having leftovers because. We need a clear room in our fridge. So that is the goal. And it is to eat all the food that we've already made. We are heading into the areas around Tenby Bay and Sturgeon Bay, which is in the southwestern part of the North Channel. And there's all these islands that are like surrounding us. It's really beautiful. Today's weather right now is just perfect. The, wa the water is super calm, which is really making the, the cruise very enjoyable. And the trees are just nice, they're beautiful, they're evergreen and just gorgeous, and the sun is hitting them, it's hitting the water. It is beautiful today. Um, but this area with all the islands, it makes me just think that, yes, we are skipping this, which is unfortunate, but it just means that for us that the North Channel would be a place that we would really love um, to come back to and explore more of. There's just so many places in the world and so many places on the loop that there's just not enough time for. But this area is remarkable and we would love to come back one day. Coming back into the US, I didn't plan us to go to a marina because we still have plenty of water, plenty of food, plenty of everything on board. Um, and there's still nice acreages to go to. However, we need to check back into the United States. So I'm using the CBP row map to check in and um, I'm gonna put the marina as a marina that's close by. So that way, if we do need to go, we can just pivot our plans and maybe go to the fuel dock or find a slip at the marina to get boarded and, and, uh, and check to make sure we're, we're cleared to come in. But it'll be our first time using the row map ever. Well, even when we were internationally traveling, we never had to do this because we were always flying and went through customs in person. See how it works. It says the request has been submitted and is waiting a review by the CVP officer, status pending, so we'll just continue cruising and uh, We'll go to the harbor first, and if we have to leave and go to the uh, marina, that's probably 45 minutes to an hour, so no problem. I've been away for far too long. Now I've been looking for something I already found In those sweet summer eyes Saying it's alright, baby Take comfort in the fear Of being alive
Light up the house and lock the door Come out and meet me on the porch Cause I'm coming home Train your eyes and set in sun No, be there when I'm done Now I'm coming home I've been a fool since the day I left your side. There's all the answers wrapped inside my arms. You're my beautiful girl, and I don't deserve. Tame a wild heart with a whisper. The request just processed and they want us to do a video chat. So Jen's gonna do a video chat while I'm here. Thanks, babe. Yeah. Love you. Love you. Alright. Status approved. The officer on the phone um, said that we'll be getting an email with a number that will confirm that we did go through customs coming back in and that if we were to get stopped by a Coast Guard um, personnel that we would give them that number to confirm you know that we did stop in customs but that's it we're all good that was super easy yes. and all they asked is for us to show our passports and like put up our face um, and the passports next to each other so they could confirm and that was it really easy Yay Whew, It's a weight off my shoulders <laughs> and now we have just arrived to Harbor Island uh, the uh, Customs officer did ask us where we were and we were, where we were headed So we obviously answered those truthfully said we were in between Harbor Island and detour And we we're going to Harbor Island to drop the anchor tonight and she you know everything was fine and um, I presume if they needed to come aboard, then we would have had to go to uh, detour or something. Uh, but all is well, that ends well. And it looks like we are heading into Harbor Island now. And I just thought that this was Harbor Island, but it's not. This is Harbor Island. And this is like pretty. Wow, this is a wild national wildlife refuge. Awesome. This is a great first anchorage in Michigan. We made it through Canada. We made it through Canada. We made it through the Georgian Bay and, and the North, North Channel, Channel without hitting a rock. <laughs> That's actually so impressive. I think I'm still in the like, I'm sad we left Canada mental state, but I'm also like really proud of us. We did that. Frickin' Frack who started it out. Now, we already started somewhere. Uh, now. Look at us, look at that. Everybody started somewhere, we just decided to put it all on YouTube. Sadly, Canada has come to an end. And so will our time showing our courtesy flag. So we're taking it down. Oh, look who's up here. Getting a little sunbathing on. Yeah, taking in that sunshine, afternoon nap. Oh, Canada. It was fun to visit you. We will come back again and have a beaver tail. Time.
We did a lot, yeah. but we left a lot to come back to. We had a loony good time. But oh. Oh boy. Good things come to an end. Yeah, look at that. That's sad. We had a great time. Yeah, we had such a good time. Now we'll have to have more good times here. Yep. More good times to be had. The loop must continue. Yeah. Ollie, how does it feel now that you're officially a world traveler? You've been uh, to a different country and back into the United States. Well, well tell me. I sure do like the rocks. How does it feel? I sure do like the rocks in Canada. I'd give it an A plus, and mm. uh, I would mm -hmm. love to come back one day. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and chase more rocks. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, oh, such a great time. Many mm. good hikes. Lots of good sniffs. Mm. Oh, so many new dog friends. What is that, Ollie? Oh, we're gonna go for a paddleboard ride? Oh my goodness. On to the paddleboard. Check to start a paddle workout. Paddling. Go, go, you got it. You excited? Do we unsure? Are you gonna chase some rocks? Oh, yeah. Oh, yep, I think you like Michigan. Michigan's pretty great. Is that a big enough rock? That's like half your size. Ready? Oh my gosh. Ready? Okay, ready? Filled with rocks. There's no way she knows which rock I threw. Dive in, girlfriend. There you go. Okay, come right here. Oh, good job. Oh boy. Girl, you did it. Oh boy. Good girl, go Wally, go. Good job. Good job. Oh, she did Oh, good girl. Good job. Good job. Good job, Ollie. Good. The first two times Ollie ever swam without the encouragement of rocks. <laughs> I can't believe Ollie swam. She's learning. We were gifted a bottle of wine from Sonoma County from our fellow loopers, Mike and Beth aboard Amy Murray. And we are celebrating today for being done with another section of the loop. Our time on the loop trying to do it last year really made us appreciate much in a much deeper sense how special each section is on the loop this year. We reach a new section and each time we do that we can't believe we made it here we can't believe like we're we're just in awe and so today we're in awe that we're in the state of michigan <laughs> back in the u.s of a back in the u.s we finished canada we did not hit a rock at least not that we know of <laughs> and we're pleased and so anyway we're just cheersing we're so so excited to be here we're sad to to have left Canada, but we're also very excited to be here. And we're excited for the next section. Yes. So, yeah, thank you, Mike and Beth, for this. Cheers. 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 Je t'aime. Je t'aime.
Mmm. That's yummy. Oh, that's a good wine. Shithead from yesterday. <laughs> oh, shithead from the time before last. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching our cruise back in to the United States of America today. Yeah, we had a great afternoon just kind of exploring this anchorage and taking in the new sights. Tomorrow we have some rain and some winds. Then the next day we also have some wind. So we are not sure what we're gonna be doing. Yeah. The only thing that's for sure is that there is absolutely zero service here. <laughs> We're like coming into like the States, we had three or four bars, like fast internet, and then like turning the corner into the anchorage, nada. <laughs> so we might just move like, I don't know, like a quarter of a mile to another anchorage, and we might just stay here and kind of stay off grid for another couple of days, <laughs> you know? <laughs> What's another couple of days? We have plenty of videos to days. edit. it. Yeah. Yeah. But thank you very much for watching this video. We really appreciate you watching our journey around America's Great Loop. And we'll see you tomorrow whenever we move next. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. All right, let's go back to Canada. <laughs> go back, go back, go back. Skirt, skirt. We're not going that way. We're not going that way. Oh, man. <laughs> Sadly, can I it? <laughs> All good things must end. It's kind of depressing. Yeah. All good things must end. <laughs> Did not mean to take that picture. Uh. I'm coming home. I'm coming home.